Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I am currently about to do my makeup, as y'all probably can tell. I'm about to do my makeup real quick because I'm about to film a video. Today is Thursday and it's almost two o'clock. The house is so quiet. Um, the kids went back to school this week. But yeah, the kids went back to school today and I wanna try to put out as much content as I can. Yeah, I am getting ready to shoot a, I guess you kind of could say it's like a Q and A video about my veneers because I get a lot of questions about it via Instagram and on YouTube. And I just want to put that all in one video so that we can just get that out the way. And if people have any more questions, I could always refer them to, you know, the Q&A videos. While we're in the beginning of this video, guys, I want to mention something really quickly before I forget. But I am seriously doing this women's group um, meetup. It's going to be a brunch here in Atlanta. I want to do like... I want to shoot for like Mar. No, I'm sorry. I want to shoot for like February. That's a good month. You know, I, I feel like people should be caught up on stuff from Christmas and like there's not much going on in February like that. So like people can kind of commit to going. Yeah, so I'm just like working out the details. I, when I tell you guys, I get so many of you guys DMing me or like reaching out to me about the women's group or the women's meetup. I just get so many and I'm just like, I'm just gonna do it. Like, I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna try it out, you guys. See how it is. Like, try out the first like little meet and greet. It's gonna be like a little meet and greet. Um, we are looking at a couple of place, places out here in Atlanta to do it, but that depends on like how many people are like actually attending. I wanna shoot for like a weekend, so like a Saturday or Sunday or something like that. I kinda just wanna do it to get out the way just so that everyone could like kind of meet each other and just see how it goes i don't have like an actual itinerary for this meet i just know i want it to be for ladies who are like me who i already described who kind of who fit in but kind of don't whether they're married or have kids or don't have kids but they're married or something like you know something that we can all relate to that's what i am putting together and i'm super excited i think i'm going to do like a facebook sign up i feel like that's easier to keep track of everything like you know just doing a facebook group so that i can keep track of like who's coming and like are you attending because i think facebook is better for that i don't do facebook like that like i I'm, i have facebook but i don't go on there but i think that when it comes to events and stuff and like groups facebook is pretty good at like people you know going on there and looking for events or being a part of groups and that a easier way for them to look for an event or something like that so but yeah i'm still super excited to do this group you guys i'm like i'm just so super excited because like i just want to have the group and then like I don't know, I just picture us like at brunch, just talking, laughing, taking pictures, filming or whatever, and then like still getting home on time for our kids and our mans. So <laughs> that's exactly what I plan on putting together. I cannot wait. Besides the whole like, you know, Corona thing, I'm just super excited to be outside and like super excited for that patio weather to come. Like if you guys live out here in Atlanta or if you live... I don't know, maybe Texas or something. I don't know. But if you guys, especially out here in Atlanta, you guys know what I'm talking about. When it gets like rooftop weather, I call it rooftop weather. Back when I, when I was a server, I could not wait for rooftop weather because all the parties would be outside and the inside be dead. <laughs> no one want a table inside. Everyone want to eat outside. So like when that type of weather comes, ugh, I love it because I love going on the roof. I love going to like rooftop dinners rooftop brunches or lunches i like going to dinner or lunch outside and eating outside it's just it's just it's just a little vibe speaking of going outside my friends this is one of my friends girls i'm gonna i'm gonna come back on here when i'm done talking hey guys it's saturday and i apologize because i have not been vlogging like that i've been extremely tired and i actually slept all day yesterday i didn't even get up um, I was super duper tired, but I am about to go to brunch. Babe just told me to get ready. I ask no questions, okay? Because we don't get a lot of alone time as it is. So I'm ready, y'all. It is almost 11 o'clock. 
Okay, I'm proud of myself. I'm a little early. It's almost 11 o'clock and we are about to head out. I just want to show you guys my outfit really quickly. All right, I'm wearing my Zara paper bag shorts that I got. Um, they're really cute and comfy. I wore these plenty of times, but yeah, they're just these little cute um, shorts, jean shorts. Let me turn the light a little bit. Is it two? Then I'm wearing my thigh high boots from Forever 21. I love these boots because they're thigh highs. They really fit. Like, see how tight they are? They fit around my thighs and they're not loose or anything. And then they have a low heel. I love these boots. They're super comfortable. I can walk in them for a long time. And then I have my pretty little thing trench coat. It has like this oversized collar. Um, it's so dope. I feel like a super cape woman when I'm wearing this um, long coat. I just love it. I will try to link it, but I don't know if they have it available on the website anymore. I got it in 2020 and y'all know they don't be restocking that much. So yeah, it does come with a belt, but I didn't wear the belt. And then I just have my Gigi Marmot. And then I have my Zoffel um, mock neck, long sleeve ribbed um, crop shirt it's really cute it's like a camel color really cute and then you yeah, guys that is the fit really cute simple showing a little leg but yeah i'm also Surprisingly, it's quiet-ish. It's not that busy in here. I just came to get some containers to um, organize my closet. Oh my gosh, they finally, I wanted this shirt so bad, you guys. Look at this. I wanted that shirt so bad, like back in December. And now, of course, they have a whole bunch of them and Christmas has already passed. Like, what? I do need some new pajamas, though. But we didn't come for that, Brittany. We came for containers. Stay focused. Oh, look, they have Valentine's Day. So cute. I had to get a strawberry side, y'all. I took my makeup off. Uh-oh. I knew it was going to happen. But I need caffeine, y'all, because I was legit falling asleep after brunch like that food put me to sleep oh this looks so nice these casa luna knit blankets but i feel like they're so fuzzy it will get everywhere but i need a new comforter you guys i want to change our bedding so bad like our sheets are ripped our bedding is just blah it's really just whatever right now it's not even like something to look at so i want to change it but I don't know to what. This looks nice, but it's brown. I kind of want to go light, so <laughs> I'm going back to like a white bedding. I actually like this linen one, this linen comforter. I've been looking at this for a while. I'm probably gonna get it because I keep looking at it. Or the white one, the linen white one. One of these I'm gonna get. So I wanna go back to cream. I wanna go back to cream, gold, and green for our bedroom. They got all the Valentine's Day decorations. Look. They got all the Valentine's Day stuff. I'm probably gonna get this for the kids. Like a pillow. Or maybe not, I don't know. Oh my gosh, these lamps are too cute. And Macy needs a new lamp. Well, she doesn't need one. But I would like to get her one. It's only 10 bucks, what? Ah, 
Oh, we're coming to um, Target. They be having the cutest stuff for cheap. So they have some greenery, which I absolutely love. They have some greenery out. This is cute. Oh yeah, they have these. This is really cute. I love these. These are really cute. I love these bottles. Let's see. It's $25. That's really cute. I like these. And I like these up top. Okay, so cute look, too. Look at this. Oh, I didn't see these. Oh, wait. Is this the same one as this one? I think this is a little bit bigger. This is cute. That's the vase I already have, guys, on my dining room table. This is really cute. I like the smoked clear one. I'm getting a plant, you guys, that is like three times the size. Um, I want an olive tree fire in the room. So I need it to be like at least eight feet tall, though. So I'm on the hunt for one of those. But this is really <clears throat> cute. Also, you guys, I am changing the reef on the door. Currently, you guys know we have this one um, already. But they think that's so plain. I like this one for like the springtime coming. Or this one. I actually like this one too, but he might say that's still boring. <laughs> but this one's really nice. I love the way this one looks. They have the baskets that I already got. You guys know I have two of these in my living room. So it's funny because their decor is cute, but it's kind of like the same stuff. It's kind of like the same stuff that I already have. This is cute too. Pop of color. So, hmm. Maybe you have to wait until it really gets warm out because I'm seeing a lot of the other stuff that I've been had. So, might have to come back. This is nice. So they had these right here. They had like the medium sized ones, which I like the way they look. So I think I'm gonna get two of these. I really need three, but I don't see a third one. Oh, they have three, but these are kind of small. This one's missing a handle actually, so. Oh, I don't know. Um, Oh my gosh, this is so cute, you guys. I need to exchange my doormat. Look at this one. This is like really modern and aesthetic looking. That one too, but I love this one. I gotta come back. Dang, I hate when I didn't I don't bring my stuff to return. This this is empty as heck. Like y'all can see it's empty, but I'm looking at some planters. I can't wait for spring. <laughs> Y'all, once New Year's is done, it's springtime. I don't care about no other holiday. I don't want it to be cold. I just want spring to come. The, look at this. Oh my gosh, it's $100. It's cute, but it's $100 for what? It ain't even. Ooh, I like this one though, too. These are so cute. Project 62. Um, some accent tables. So cute. I could have these on the patio. We need these on the patio. Oh my gosh, yes. Love that. I actually need something like this. But not $100, though. I don't know if I want to pay $100. But I need something like this for the front door. And put like a nice plant on. And then they have some more outdoor rugs. Oh, I need this. The one I have is gone. It was moldy and everything. Ugh. 
disgusting i need a new one this is really cute i need to get this one because what i have i know exactly what i'm gonna do for the outdoors i want like this pillow in like something like this or this and um a nice plant that i already have yeah I, i'm gonna do my front yard y'all i already see the end spell coming i'm back home and i am in the closet as you can tell this is our downstairs closet and i don't even want to show you guys my side of the closet <laughs> it's looking real real terrible like i don't even know and i'm super tired my eyes are puffy i'm super tired still but um yeah i'm gonna just you know set you guys up so you can watch me straight out my closet and see i'm gonna throw away a lot of the old um stuff that i don't need like i have shirts and just outfits that i really do not wear anymore and the problem with me is i'm always saying well maybe i'll wear it one day and then i just never do it it just stays in my closet and that's how clutter starts so i'm just going to get rid of it if i haven't worn it in the past six months it's leaving like it's gone finito out of here so that's what i'm gonna do i also have a lot of clothes that have bleach on them and i'm not talking about like obviously these pants are like bleached on purpose but i mean like clothes that have bleach on them and they're not supposed to like i just accidentally clean with a lot of bleach and i i clean with a lot of bleach so accidentally i bleach my clothes i gotta get rid of those shirts too because it's just no point in them so so you guys are gonna watch me declutter on a saturday night that's what we're doing and yeah let's get to it my closet is all done the floor is cleared minus this right here i need to get another one of these or like two more of these container organizers i know i showed at target i got the brown one but i just felt like i would get more for my money if i bought these because the brown one was just one big one i needed like a bunch of them so i'm just gonna get like two more of these and have somewhere I can put my sweats because these are all sweats like I have a lot of sweats so I need about two more of these container things but for right now I have that right there I just organized like tank tops hoodies and all that up there and then right here is really skimp like this is stuff I barely wear but want to keep it's not much I actually got rid of a lot of stuff so that's right there and then right here is my robes and stuff and then my jackets are in the back and these are just like some small purses that i kind of don't wear and then like my everyday bag is right there and then and then over here i have just like a pair of slippers boots and all of my yeezys i keep my yeezys down here because i wear them the most um upstairs i have my actual pax closet system which is shoes that I bring out once in a while but the Yeezys I wear like every day so I kept them right there and yeah nothing fancy I have I also have this clothes rack in my luggage right here but that's just because I have nowhere else to put it I actually want to get rid of this clothes rack because I don't need it anymore but um but yeah this is my side of the closet pretty simple pretty simple and easy just simple and organized i just got rid of a lot of stuff and i feel so much better but yeah that's it i am done i'm so tired like my eyes are closing like i'm so freaking tired but i wanted to come on here before i close the vlog out and 
tell you ladies about the group that I've started. So if you remember my blog where I ranted about not fitting in, I actually started a Facebook group. A lot of you may know about this already because you follow me on Instagram. And um, yeah, if you follow me on Instagram, then you'll know that I started the group already, but I will link it below. This is a group full of women who are like-minded, who love luxury things, but also like to go out and have a good time and have good conversation, drama-free, no crazy emotions involved or nothing like that. We're just a group of classy women who love to do things alike. Remember how I told you guys, like just females like me, I wanted to meet like who, either are in a relationship, married, have kids or whatnot, even if you don't, like you're just like-minded and no drama, no drama at all. And just love to have a good time, we'll look cute, go out and yes. Yeah. So I will leave the link below. I will show you guys the group. So this is a group right here. It's called Gorgeous Gorgeous Girls Fit In Two because we absolutely do. And the group is growing. It's a private group, so I will I will have this link below if you want to join. I will be doing a meet and greet soon. It will be in Atlanta for the first time because I live in Atlanta and I'm not traveling at this moment. So I will be doing a meet and greet soon. If you live in the Atlanta area, I will let you know. The details will be posted in the group as well as on my Instagram page. So just make sure you are um, keeping up. Also, um, feel free to introduce yourself and tell us about you or whatever because I want everyone to get to know each other and start seeing the similarities within each other. But yeah, guys, I am about to go to sleep or just lay down. I am so tired. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and have a wonderful weekend. If you wanna see more vlogs, just hit the subscribe button and make sure your bells are turned on. But yeah, guys, I'm so tired. Your girl's going to sleep, okay? I will see y'all in my next vlog. Bye.